Hey, it's just me from The Point Shop. I'm reacting to Dance Academy. I think it was season one that I reacted to. I did not watch the whole season, but we're reacting now to season two. Here we go. Oh, sorry guys, snooze mishap. Everybody's on holidays except for us, pretty Fontaine slate. So I've got classwork today, coaching tomorrow. Oh, Tara, I've made an executive decision. You'll be doing prelude lace or feeds, not the red shoes. Got the Academy's reputation to think about. Rude. I always knew she was competitive. I just didn't think it would affect That me. mean girl, she has actually <laughs> very pretty feet. <laughs> Almost chilled. For Abigail. She was, but with the pre coming up, makes me sound paranoid, but it's like she's out to get me. Grace! I wonder if this I'm is Grace. like true. I don't think I was ever in like a super catty environment, but is this like a real thing or yeah, is this yeah. so exaggerated? So the other night was fun, like we should do it again soon. You, me, Grace. Grace plays with voodoo dolls and you still sleep with a teddy bear. I wouldn't be swapping friendship bracelets. You don't have to be jealous of her dancing. You've moved past that. Is this like her redemption story? I feel like she's gonna turn around. Daddy, it's me. Oh, look at this. Just doing the splits with the point shoes all around her. I'm totally buying you guys a present. Just as soon as you and- That was not a good sound. It just literally snapped. <laughs> no one wants to hear that. It's not supposed to just snap like that. I was so paying attention to the point she ASMR that like, I have no idea what just happened. Is she the mean girl then? Oh, you villain. Gotcha. Weird. I thought these had more life in them. You get them for free at the Royal. Nice little shoemaker. Looks like a wizard. Not when you're in school. These are broken as well and I've only just sewn the ribbons on. Yeah, mine too. Oh, so she was breaking them on purpose. Okay, I see. So she snapped them on purpose. I like how everyone is like wearing block though. This is a very Australian thing. This is so nerve wracking. Can I possibly go later? <sighs> Let me think. No. Just tell her they're broken. Oh, she looks so good. Oh, those look like demi point shoes. Guys, don't fall asleep on the sidelines. What are you taking from this? Best port of brass since Darcy Bustle. Abigail? It's supposed to be on point. Yeah. Kind of glaring, isn't it? Stop being lazy, Tara. If you've got blisters, you need to lift that body weight up off your feet. Those look so dead. Dang, girl. Sweetie, some people might tell you that your feet are amazing, but they're actually not that strong. And if you dance in broken shoes, you'll just injure yourself. I don't know what happened to them. It's your responsibility to be prepared. Sabotage. Yeah, I can make them last a little bit longer. I know, it's a lot of money. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Aw, kind of We were gonna hang out. All of my point shoes are broken, all of Grace's point shoes are broken, and I want to believe that you've changed, but... Why would I have broken your point shoes? Oh, because I'm deeply threatened by that bland solo you're doing. <laughs> Ooh, I can't believe how much of your crap I put up with. What, what sort of a pathetic freak are you? I don't know if this brings me joy, like... I didn't touch them. Well, who else would? Grace would. But you wouldn't believe me, would you? Grace is the least competitive person here and she's hardly gonna break her own shoes. So no. I don't believe you. I'm not for drama. Like, it's not, it does not bring me joy. The cinematic shots. I'm gonna go to Australia one day. That's me one and you nil. And I'm still only in second gear. So I, I'm guessing Grace is the one, the blonde with the short hair. Grace, you're whack. And I'm rising above. Enjoy round two. Thanks. 
I will say the dancing on this is like very convincing. Like these are like academy students. I feel like it was casted pretty well. Wow. Is it all of them dancing? It's pretty good. That was fantastic, Abigail. And you even wore appropriate footwear. Abigail, may I speak with you? Outside. Ooh. I'm getting sucked I need in you to now. to explain why you felt the need to target and victimize two of your fellow students. I think you should talk to your goddaughter about that, Miss Ray. You already did. Grace is worried about you, and I have to agree. I've booked you an appointment to see your therapist again. This I had thought nothing... you've moved on from first year, but this jealousy is obviously an issue that needs to be resolved. And I want you to apologize to Grace and Tara. Do I have a choice? Apologize and compete in the Prix de Fontaine, or don't apologize and don't compete. Are there any non-dancers that watch this show? Like, if you're a non-dancer that watched this, like, let me know. What does this look like to you? So I've been told I have to apologize. Actually, I am sorry for hiding your costume last year and for the way I acted when we first met. Hey, Rumi. I arrive eager and ready to carry your boxes. It doesn't matter anymore. I just don't think we were ever meant to be roommates. Aww. Where's the justice? Uh, where's my apology? She'll work you out. Okay, this is very, I feel like I need a happy ending or something because I don't know, man. How many episodes are there? Oh my gosh. I don't, I don't know if I can cringe through like that long. <laughs> okay, well, if you guys are non-dancers or dancers that watch this, comment below and let me know what you think about this show because like there's a lot of drama happening and I feel so bad for this girl, Abigail. Let me know how it goes. I'll see you guys later.